In this video, I'm going to show you how to find the top n within a category. And therefore, I'm using the sample superstore data set. And let's say uh, we create a view using region and subcategory uh, by cells. And I'm going to sort the data in descending order by our cells. And therefore, let's say we want to show the top n. For example, we may want to show the top two uh, subcategories within each region or the top three subcategories within each region. So how can we do that? We're going to use either rank or index. Let me first of all use index and I'm going to create a calculated field. Let's call it index. And the contents will be index. And I'm going to drag that calculated field to the detail. Let me change it to discrete and add it to the view. And I'm going to change the way tablet computes at the index by selecting compute pane down. So we can have the index restart for every region. And now you can show this index as a filter. And you're going to realize now anytime you select, let's say, uh, the top five products, tablet will return the top five products for every region. So that's one way. The other way we could create a calculated field called rank and the contents will be, I'm going to use rank unique uh, of the sum of cells and let me remove index to my view and I'm going to add rank to the detail, change it to discrete and add it to my view and compute it uh, paint down so to have it restart for every region and now you can also show uh, your filter and when you select let's say top three tablet will return the top three products in every region so that's one way to uh, to show uh, the top end within a category the other way we can try to make this dynamic by simply adding a parameter and to do that I'm going to create parameter Let's call it top n and the contents, I'm going to change data type to integer and let's first of all show the top five products. And okay, this one already exists. Okay, so uh, let's call it top n underscore one. Okay, and let's show this parameter in our view. And what we're going to do, we're going to link our view uh, with the parameter using this calculation. So I'm going to call it a uh, parameter uh, underscore calculation. And this will be the content. I'll say uh, I'm going to use rank, basically what I've used in my view. So I'm going to say if rank uh, is less or equals to uh, my top n underscore one, basically I want to link it to this parameter and click OK. Now let's remove rank from the filters and add a parameter calculation. Let me choose true. And now you can see anytime you change uh, your parameter, let's say top two, tablet will return the top two products uh, in each region. If we change to top five, tablet will also change or rather will return the top five products in each region. And basically that's how you can show the top N uh, within a category. Thanks everyone.